of my black ghost uh, knife fish. This is a male. I've had him for more than a year, about 11 inches long, and uh, I just uh, had the bright sunlight shining in through my east uh, kitchen window, and I thought, I think this might be a pretty interesting study on uh, black ghost knife. Might be able to see his eye just a little bit, but uh, usually the bright sun uh, never comes into the house like this, and uh, you can really see the interesting uh, <coughs> anal caudal, well, let's see, the lower fin on the uh, ghost knife moving, maintaining his position. He feels uh, like he's hiding inside of this, uh, behind this half tube that I have here in the aquarium, and he's really not hiding at all, but his electric uh, sensory uh, system tells him that uh, he's uh, secure. He uh, Ordinarily, you're told always that they don't like bright lights, but this guy, if he didn't like bright lights, he could easily swim out of uh, this uh, bright light and get into some dim light. And so... It's uh, contradictory to uh, what uh, you're told is normal for black ghost knife fish because this is most assuredly bright sunlight, bright direct sunlight just coming through a couple layers of glass. Here's the nose of my fire eel. Uh, Cinderella here has uh, is growing approximately a half to maybe three quarters of an inch a month, and uh, really in a very fast. <laughs> Look at her; she's very shy this morning. Just backing up, backing up. There's a little Cindantus. She's backing clear up out of her. Uh... Oh, look at that! <laughs> That'd be darn. She backed up all the way out of her container. I thought she would be coming out frontwards, but uh, she didn't. She's about 20 four inches long now. By the end of February she should be 25. <laughs> well, maybe 24 and a half. she'd like to eat some food this morning. I'll have to go get her some. <laughs> 